Hi guys, I am Andre. We are here to shoot over a bottle of rosé that is our final shirt of this season one and we are so excited. We have all the team and crew here and yeah, we are gonna do it man. <laughs> Thank you. Guys, can we just reset on that? We need you remember half the pace for the walking. Okay. Cool. So it's back to one. Back to ones, guys. Let's just do that on the roll. Okay. To be honest, it, like I do like um, it's Edgar Wright. I do like his style of. Yeah. So I remember reading something. It was a book. It was real fucking dickish, but it was like how things enter the frame and how things exit the frame. Okay. There's like lots of comedy in it. Yeah. Which I think we're doing a lot in yeah. our thing. You know, like yeah. pan, huh? pan, pan, that, bam, bam. Like even here when you're in the background, like yeah. bam, like the whole thing just makes it so much more. Yeah. Dang. Otherwise, it's yeah. just you guys fucking talking. Yeah. Like, yeah, so it's like boom boom. There's no real drama because there's no conflict. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's all internal conflict. Yes. Which is not interesting. At least we make it interesting. Does my hair look okay or should I put the beanie on? Hello, I'm here with Courtney Stowers. Hey guys. He will be directing the film Over a Bottle of Rose. And why did you decide uh, to direct this film? What was your interest about it? Uh, well, first off, I just want to give a shout out to Film Locos and um, Victor. Thanks for putting everything together. Uh, first thing that really interested me in this project was what Film Locos is trying to do, which is, you know, tell Latin American stories in the UK setting um, that are representative of actual um, life for um, people of this community. And what really interested me in this short film is that it's just a slice of life film that is nice to watch you know we're taking a step into these characters life it's a small moment there's nothing huge or consequential it's just a little preview into oh this is what life is like for them and I feel like in the modern 21st century everyone has that interest at times to kind of jump in and be like oh what's this person doing what's this person and I think we have the opportunity to create quite a fun poppy script with it so yeah amazing and I'm gonna ask that boring question okay. because it's fascinating okay and, uh, what's a boring I question people will be like as well so where See. are you from I am from New Zealand my mom's Italian so shout out to all my Italians and um, my dad is Samoan so hello for lava to all my Samoans out there and yeah I've moved over to London about two years ago so two years European now maybe gonna stay a bit longer who knows but um yeah, definitely for season two of Film Loco, so definitely be around then, so at least one more year. And um, what do you want to take from the film? What exactly we want to capture in Over a Bottle of Rosé? What I would like to capture is that sense of want. So everyone's been on a first date, or if you haven't, trust me, it's exciting. So you know, good luck. But, um, you know, first, second day, when you're really getting to know someone, you, the feeling of wanting someone, the feeling of wanting to be wanted, and the nerves between those two. Like, you know, I want someone, but I'm not sure if they want me, and there's a kind of clash there. But um, it's a funny clash, because a lot of other human emotions are kind of big and out there. This one is one that we're trying to hide behind, sorry, behind a veil. Um, you know, we're trying to look cool for the other person that we're on a date with, but really on the inside, there's this big emotional thing going on. So I'd really like to capture that. <laughs> 
I'm so excited. I can't wait to see the final product and I'm pretty sure you're gonna capture everything you just said. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you guys. See you later. on the film over a bottle of rosé and uh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Glad to have you on set and how are you feeling today? I'm feeling great. I'm excited to, to get out there and um, play some scenes through with, uh, with Sammy. Amazing. I don't know if you know but it was really hard to cast Mattis. So can you tell a little bit more about your character? Yeah, of course. Um, so I'm a, uh, a music uh, student. Um, I, I think I've, I like to think that I've uh, got a handle on what I want out of life. And uh, my interaction with one will, will force me to look a little bit closer at, at how I think about my life and, and how I interact with him will teach me a bit about myself as well as, as, well as help him on his way. Awesome, no doubt we found Mattis. <laughs> and uh, have you worked with Courtney before? No, I haven't. I'm excited to. Um, we obviously, we've worked closely together on the development of this. And um, he seems like a fun guy to work with so far. Yeah. Uh, so I'm really looking forward to it. And what do you think about the platform, Film Locals? How did you find out about us? So I found out uh, directly from the casting call from Courtney. And then obviously, I've done uh, quite a bit of research since then. And I think it's a really important and exciting initiative that's doing something that probably should have been done a long time ago so I'm really glad uh, to be involved. Hello! Hi there! I'm here with Sami Atala which will be working in the film Over a Bottle of Rosé. Yep. How are you feeling today Sami? I'm feeling very excited and just happy that we're, you know, we're making another film today. Just yes. this time I'm going to be in front of the camera. This is amazing. Can you tell a little bit more about your character? Yes, cool. So uh, I'm going to be playing Juan, who is a kind of young graduate who's very, let's say, new and looking to explore the world and trying to figure out who he is, really. That's cool. And have you worked with Courtney before? I have behind the scenes in production but not as actor-director, so I'm very excited. We already uh, got together yesterday to do a bit of blocking and a little run-through, so that was great. And yeah, just buzzing to see what happens today. Amazing, I can't wait to see the final product. Thank you very much. Thank you. Break the leg. Does it look old? It yes. looks like me, right? So. <laughs> Cracked and broken, but still useful. Yeah. Ooh, Needing yeah. a daddy's yeah. love. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. He needs a case. That's good.